Hello and welcome to a new Hostify how-to video. Today we're going to be discussing how to manage VLANs on the USW Flex Mini. This switch is unlike any other Unify switch as custom port profiles are not supported. So this guide will explain how to untag VLANs on the Flex Mini switch using the Unify application. So I have a, a Flex Mini switch here, the 5 gigabit ports in total. Uh, port 1 takes PoE in at 802.3 AF. On the rear there's a USB-C port for powering it if you don't have PoE. The other four ports are standard non-PoE ports of powering up a device like a TV or a Switch or an Xbox and that sort of thing. Um, so we're going to be discussing how to log into the Unify application and then look at assigning VLANs on each port. So we'll be following our guide here. This guide is actually linked in the description. So if you need a, a screenshot by screenshot guide, um, you can find that find that below. Um, we're, going to be we're going to be showing you how to do it in the new GUI and the old GUI and what you cannot do with the Flex Mini Switch. So, I'm going to go into the new GUI first. So, log into your Hostify controller and then go to Devices and you'll see your Flex Mini switch if it's already adopted. Um, and you can manage the ports. So, in this example, I have a I have two VLANs on my on my system. I have the default VLAN controlled by my UXG Pro, and I have VLAN 80 as a VLAN only a VLAN only network. Um, I've also got some custom port profiles to show you that these won't appear for the Flex Mini switch. So I've got two, I've got Villain 80 that's, that's untagged, uh, and then I've also got um, a, a, test, a test network which has our default VLAN untagged and the VLAN 80 tagged. So go back to devices, go to the Flex Mini switch. You can see in the port section here that port one is my uplink, port two's got nothing connected. We're gonna, we're gonna actually be configuring port two to have a, a VLAN on it. So port two, you can see you've got the port profile drop down. So I can have all the VLANs, which is all of my VLANs tagged, and then the default VLAN untagged. You can have the network as disabled, so that'll turn the port off. Or I can just assign two VLANs, so I can have um, my LAN network as untagged, or my VLAN 80 network as untagged. I cannot have any custom port profiles, unfortunately. It's the only Unify switch in the lineup that um, that's a limitation on. So go back to settings, we'll just show it in the old GUI instead. So in the legacy interface, we'll go over the networks again. So we've got networks, uh, I've got my VLAN 80 VLAN only network, my default uh, network here, controlled by the UXG Pro. And then our custom port profiles are in profiles, switch ports, and then you can have VLAN 80 and your test uh, custom port profile, which I made earlier. Again, same thing, it's tagging VLAN 80, untagging um, VLAN, well, the default VLAN, native just means untagged. So go back to devices, you can see our Flex Mini switches here, pop that out, it's a bit easier to see. Um, go to ports, port 2, edit, and now we have the drop down again for our custom port profiles. On the Flex Mini switch, you can, again, you can only untag, untag one VLAN at a time or select the all profile. Um, if you need any more help with this, uh, have a look at our guide, which is linked below, how to manage VLANs on the Flex Mini switch. Um, there's lots of different screenshots, step by step, what we've covered in this video. If you need any, if you need any help, contact us at support at hostify.com or use the live chat in the bottom right hand corner of any website on any page on the website. Um, I've been Alex. Thank you for watching this Hostify video.